welcome back you guys so i already have my hair section off in place i already did a blowout so i got a little inches to it let's see yeah so yeah don't believe the hype with the naturals because we do be here for some inches all right you guys so this is my hair blown out yes let's take a look from the back Yeah, it's how this look and I put in all my products before I did my blowout because it would be crazy to do it when it's dry. My goal for this year is to have thicker hair and it's like girl your hair is already thick. It's not thick enough for me. I'm about to just section it off. I'm going to section from like top to bottom and then we're going to go from there. So I'm going to just say this. Yeah, girl, love YouTube. Thank you, YouTube, for helping me out. Because without YouTube, I really, I think, like, a lot of us will be lost. So, with the rollers, I'm going to be using, flexorize, I'm going to be using, it's like, multiple different sets. So, different um sizes. Because, your girl, I don't know, I don't like doing one size. I feel like it all depends on, like, the length of your hair for if you want to use, like, a thicker flex it right or a skinny one but I like the different size I feel like it makes the hair look bigger so I saw a girl on I was watching Facebook well I was on Facebook and I saw a video of this girl doing this method she used gel eco styler and I know eco styler you know it's canceled but your girl still got some so I feel like I could just use like this last little bit and then I could probably just start um, making my own so I'm going to do like a few on camera and then I'm going to do the rest off because your girl ain't about to waste time because I told y'all I want to keep it very, very, very short. Yeah, my hair smells so freaking good. I love wash day. But I hate, oh, I put too much gel on that one. I hate to blow dry my hair. That's why I try to, rare, that's why I rarely do it. If so, but always use heat protectant before you do blow dry, because who want to have heat damage? <laughs> Oh yeah, and the reason why I like to use like smaller curl, smaller flexorize at the back, like at the very bottom row, is just to make it, uh, I just like more curls and it's like, I know when I do thicker flexorize, the curls are more loose and it's like I really want to achieve a tight curl, probably not as tight as my natural curl pattern, which I really have to show you guys because that first video was just dried up, shrunken up and everything else. But it's like, my hair is more like a 4A, 4B. But when I don't do it, it could look like a 4C. But one thing I say when I do blow dry my hair, it's very easy, easily to be straightened. But I don't be wanting to look like I flat iron. As you see, I have everything already rolled up in the back. Everything is done. So I'm just waiting on the front. Trying to figure out how I can just like probably make space for another one somewhere, but I ain't about to do more that I don't need. So we're gonna roll this up. I don't know if I wanted to just like do the natural roll up or not, cause I can't really remember which one works best for me. But I know this is the way that the girl I saw on Facebook did it. So, well, I ain't gonna say the girl on Facebook, cause. Because she probably have a YouTube channel and it's probably on there, but somebody else featured her on their um, Facebook. But I really like the way that she did it, so I wanted to recreate that look for myself. Plus, I'm going to say the only thing different is that her hair was way longer than mine's. And so, I, of course, mine's not going to look exactly like hers, but... Just to have the curls I'm okay with. I really don't care if it's going to be long or short or anything. Because, you know, I love looking like a little curly too. It's all how you manipulate it and make it bigger. But 
we're gonna see when that time comes. You see my handy dandy bonnet. I'm about to put this on and go to sleep and see y'all in a few more hours. All right, you guys, so it's been a few hours and I'm back. So we just about to go down and take down. So let's get ready. So I'm starting it from the back. I hope it's dry. Okay, I see which way out. So twisting the angle. For the takedown, as you can see, it is curly. Curly for the girls. So, you know, I don't like this one, but we just gonna work because all of this curl. Now, this thing, I just hope it lasts because whenever I do a blowout on my hair and I do like anything to it, it tends to get straight very quick. So, I'm just gonna do like the minimal of. Um, separating because I want this to last the whole weekend so just put this on my fingers like this <laughs> Slide back a little and do a little 360. <laughs> yes, yeah, first I'm doing the 360 probably last time. So I got my little pick. Got my handy dandy pick. Forgot the name of it. So we just gonna flip it out. love these curls I don't know if I might keep it like this I might do this for like the first day probably do like a style on the second day but this is how this gonna look for the weekend I don't know I kind of like it it bounces it's not as short as I thought it would have been cuz I thought my stuff was gonna be like up here but it's not I got lit got lit hang time you know so you guys, if you like this look, like I love this look, just give me a comment below, give me a thumbs up, and subscribe you guys. And I just want to thank you guys for just tuning into my channel. Hope you guys love my look because I am really feeling this you guys. Like this is my first time doing it this way. So I want to say be pretty by being yourself and love the skin that you're in. And I will see you guys next time.